Hey everyone, this is Jared Trotter with Go Engineer, and today I want to introduce you to some of the great new capabilities with sketching in SOLIDWORKS 2020. Sketching in SOLIDWORKS continues to be easier and more accessible with each release, and 2020 really enhances the user experience on touch-enabled devices. With the new Power Modify option, it's easy to make quick edits, like adding these sketch fillets to the base profile. This saves time because you can use gestures rather than picking the individual tools. Now in SOLIDWORKS 2020, you can enter dimensions without needing a physical keyboard. Just touch inside the number field and use the pop-up window to enter a dimension. Convert Entities is a great way to quickly create sketch geometry that is based on existing geometry. This and other commands can be easily added and accessed in the customizable shortcut toolbar. As you would expect, sketch relations can still be managed with the toolbar on the left in touch mode. This way, managing the intricacies of your design intent is literally at your fingertips. Zebra stripes can be used to check the continuity of curved surfaces. Let's examine some new options for tangency to get smoother profiles. Inserting a spline between these lines will give us maximum control. Clicking on an endpoint, we see two options. One is the established equal curvature feature, but now we also have G3 continuity, which makes the rate of change of the curvature equal to the adjacent sketch entity. At any time, you can access the enhanced undo functionality which gives you more control over the edits you've made. A drop-down menu shows a history that you can select from and go back to that specific change. Some quick edits are needed to tidy up this cut extrude, and this is an easy task whether you're working on your desktop or with a touch-enabled device. With these enhancements, you can get your ideas into SOLIDWORKS even faster, regardless of which device you're working from. That concludes this segment of sketching in SOLIDWORKS 2020, and make sure to check out our other videos of what's new in next year's release. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.